Hey, what's up, guys? Meteorologist Doug Hediot is Thursday, so we're cruising through the week toward Christmas, of course. We do have a couple big storm systems which are going to be heading toward us as we go through the next several days. So we're going to be talking about that, and then you want to stick around because we're going to do another giveaway, a contest uh, here in just a bit. So pay attention to what I talk about uh, because that we're going to do a, a guessing contest very similar to what we did last week on the giveaway where we guessed uh, how much rain we would see at the Joplin Airport. All right, so first off, we have the clouds. You can see the rain increasing. This is all out um, oh, central western parts of Kansas and this is all going to head toward us. Now through the daytime hours for us today, we are going to see hit and miss, light little sprinkles and showers, but you can see the rain really increasing west of Wichita, west of Oklahoma City. There's a batch out across central parts of Missouri as well. So just kind of a gloomy day for everyone across the region. But look at the rain. So this is west of Wichita, Dodge City, uh, Jetmore, south of Hayes. We can drop south, uh, Guymon, Forgan, uh, western parts of Oklahoma. So this is a weak wave. There's a much stronger wave which is just to the west. Look at this spin off the coast of California, just west of Los Angeles. That is our next upper level low. That will affect us with thunderstorms by the time we get into Christmas Eve. All right, so let's go through time for you this afternoon. Hit and miss little sprinkles across Missouri, southwest Missouri, northwest Arkansas, but a band of light showers, Wichita to Oklahoma City. Let's continue through the evening hours. Rain pushes in. Starts to get into Topeka, southeast Kansas, northeastern Oklahoma. This is going to be light. So this is about 9.30 p.m. As we go through the overnight hours, bands of light rain through Kansas City, moving into Columbia, Lake of the Ozarks, Springfield, Joplin, northwest Arkansas. And then the light rain continues to push east and kind of out of the region. The most of the day tomorrow is just going to be kind of spitting a little bit of drizzle. Uh, a random light shower with the clouds sticking around. In fact, uh, Kansas, Oklahoma, you may break out and see a little bit of sunshine as we get into the afternoon. Now, remember, I look at uh, about 10 to 12 different models. They all say something different, but the average of a rainfall at the Joplin Airport with this system is probably about two-tenths of an inch, so keep that in mind. All right, let's continue as we go into Saturday. Clouds thicken again, but look at these temps. We shoot into the mid-60s, 60, 60 in Wichita, 64 Joplin, 64 Oklahoma City, and then watch the band of thunderstorms tracking across the state of Kansas. This is going into Christmas Eve. Last year, we had a white Christmas, but we're going to have thunderstorms Sunday morning, and then most of us Sunday afternoon, just light showers. Eastern Kansas, eastern parts of Oklahoma, Missouri, and then also Arkansas. As we go into Christmas morning, it's going to be a wet start, Missouri, Arkansas, uh, even eastern Oklahoma, eastern Kansas. A little bit better once you get out across central and western Kansas. And then most of the day on Christmas is just going to be chilly with light showers. So, of course, uh, we're going to do a, another contest giveaway. First off, I'm going to bring in Superior Roofing. I'm actually at third place today and we of course i always talk about superior roofing and construction they did my roof last fall if you guys want to come step in we got cole we got carlos so these are the guys that i'm always talking about and of course thanks man they did uh my roof last fall uh if you guys have roofing needs numbers right there on the screen you guys want to say anything before we do the giveaway Hey guys, my name is Cole Slaughter. This is Carlos Carrasco. Uh, we're a couple of the co-owners of Superior Roofing and Construction. Uh, we just want to say thank you for all of the support we've had over the last year on this page and this channel with Mr. Meteorologist Doug Hetty. Uh, we want to wish you guys a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holidays. Uh, what we're going to do uh, for this occasion, we're going to match Mr. Hetty's giveaway. So we're going to also give away another $50 gift card to add to that. So someone will win this holiday season a $100 gift card. So again, we just want to say thank you so much for the support. Um, happy holidays and Merry Christmas to everyone. Uh, we look forward to hearing from you next year. And thank you for the ones we've heard from this year. It's been such an honor to take care of your roofing and construction needs. Sweet. All right, so here's how this is going to go. So we're getting rain that's going to pick up later today, tonight, into tomorrow. So here are the rules. One, you got to go to Superior Roofing Facebook, like their page. Two, you got to subscribe to my YouTube. Now, if you can guess how much rain we're going to get at the Joplin Airport, uh, we'll cut it off like at noon tomorrow. 
uh, meaning that's the end of the contest, like that's when the final amount is in, without going over the mark. So like I told you, most of the models are saying about two tenths of an inch. So you don't want to go over the mark and you have to put your answers on this link on YouTube. So underneath uh, the video in the comments section. Very similar to what we did last week. Uh, we'll cut off, you have to have all your guesses in by 6 p.m. tonight. And then, it, so it's going to be from how much rain we get at the drop on airport from 6 p.m. tonight till noon tomorrow. Person who gets the closest to the mark without going over. All right, guys, good chatting with you, and I'll let you know the winner tomorrow.